Good morning, kindergarten friends. Boy, did I miss you yesterday. I hope you all had a wonderful long Memorial Day weekend and welcome back to school. Today is Tuesday and I'm looking at our seasons chart right now and I think someone's playing a trick on us. We had some cool, rainy spring days last week and then all of a sudden it felt like a really hot summer day but it is still spring. I think they're trying to trick us. We are in the month of May. Let's take a look at our calendar. I think today is a very special day for someone. It is. I see our birthday star on today's date. Who remembers whose birthday it is? That's right. Happy birthday, Mallory. Today is Tuesday, May 26th. Today is Mallory's birthday. I'm going to move her birthday star while we practice writing the date for today. The month is May. That is the fifth month of the year. The day is the 26th, Mallory's birthday. And we are still in the year 2020. 5-26 dash 20. All right, let's take a look. I'm, oops, I am going to add a ones block to our day count. How many ones do I have now? That's right, I've got three ones, not enough to trade in. I still need five, six, seven more. So that means I still have six tens and 100. If I have 100, six tens and three ones, how many days have we been in school? 163. All right. Let's keep going. Go ahead and draw a window on your whiteboards. Zoop. All right, and now I'm gonna switch back to my pen while I gather my dice to roll for the morning. Here we go. Let's see, oh my goodness, easy peasy. Our blue dice looks like this, one, two, and one. How many are on my blue dice? That's right, we've got three on the blue side. And look at this, you're not gonna believe how easy this is. Our pink dice looks like this. How many are on the pink dice? Two. We've got two small numbers. Three plus two equals, that's right, five. Three plus two equals five. One, two, three, four, five. So our number of the day is five. Five has a long neck, a big fat belly, and a hat on top. Five is a clown. All right, let's do a subtraction story with the number five. This weekend, I planted five daisies. But, after I planted the daisies, a hungry bird came along and ate some of my daisies. Let's find out how many of my daisies that hungry bird ate. Oops, too many. I don't have six daisies. Let's try it again. Oh my goodness, six again. Okay, how many? Four. So let's write this out, five daisies. I have five daisies. A hungry bird came along and took some away. So we're going to write the minus or the subtraction sign. The hungry bird took four daisies away. Let's see. One, two, three, four. How many daisies do I have left? I better take good care of it. I only have one daisy left. Oh my goodness. All right, let's practice our tally marks. One, two, three, four, five. I can't do anything else. So that means five 
plus nothing, zero, equals five. All right, finish writing out your morning math work. Press pause if you need to, to finish that up, and then join us. All right, erase your board and get ready for our morning message of the day. Morning message of the day. I'm going to write the sentence, it feels like summer, okay? It feels like summer. Go ahead and try it. I'm gonna start writing it and then we'll do some of it together. If you're not sure, just wait a minute until I get to that word and you can see how we work it out together. It is a snap word. It feels, feels, what's the first part? F, F E, O, S. And there's, I'm gonna add a word, a letter in here, this tricky little silent E. It feels like, like is a snap word. You should know the word like. It feels like summer, summer. I can hear that beginning. S uh, what vowel do you hear? Uh, some, summer. Some er, and I'm going to add two tricky silent letters in here. Summer. It feels like summer. Go ahead and write your morning message. Pause the video if you need to. I can't wait to read uh, Mallory's birthday book next. And then we have some fun activities for you today. Happy Tuesday.